Kwa 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 arrangement kwa 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 the challenge of solid waste management on the copper belt has persisted despite promising interventions from government through local authorities. While low density townships in Indola have remained clean because of the commendable garbage collection by copper belt solid waste management Cop West, high density areas such as Masala, where some low income households can't afford to pay for solid waste collection services, the problem is posing a health and environmental challenge. For areas like Masala, where Ndola City Council is expected to provide collection services, the local authority has no skips, prompting Zambia Institute of Environmental Management ZM Chief Executive Officer Morgan Katati to call on the new PF-led government to quickly mobilize resources for garbage collection before the onset of the rain season. Ndola is a very big uh, city and with huge populations and you can imagine the uh, you know waste generation is quite high and uh, they only have one dump site one dump site in Kaloko and that is very serious because this dump site is not even you know a managed dump site it's just a place where they go and dump but we are talking about reducing greenhouse gases that may come and may arise from this and moreover when you look at uh, the way they dump here this is serious because people are bringing their waste here uh, which most of it are plastics and uh, to the larger extent none biodegradable they are bringing and they, they burn right here that is serious that is a very serious uh, issue of management zambia's contribution to climate change is through land use change resulting from activities such as open air burning water and land pollution a move that should see issues such as solid waste management be addressed holistically